Real quick, if you guys haven't already, please make sure to hit the like button and subscribe. Only about 6% of my current viewers are subscribed, and it helps out the channel quite a bit. So, I've noticed a big thing going around with the War Thunder community right now, and that is the MiG-29. So, the MiG-29 is a single-seat twin-engine fighter that is was produced by the Soviets in the 70s to counter the American F-15, or, well, the F-15, uh, to counter the F-16, I mean. So, the MiG-29 is an aircraft that is actually pretty, pretty unique in the fact that not a lot of people, you know, seem to understand that it is actually a pretty decent aircraft. So, the biggest argument right now that I see around is that the MiG-29 is underperforming in War Thunder, which is true, but not these people who are saying this are not also correct. Now, a lot of these people say that the MiG-29 is to par, on par with the F-15 and should be performing better than the F-16 and should be better than the F-18. This is not true. It should still under, it should still lose in a fight against an F-18 or an F-16 or an F-15, but it should be a lot closer than what it is right now. And part of this is due to the F-16s massively overperforming in game right now in terms of G. But also the MiG-29 flight model not really being what it should be. So the MiG-29 at above a certain speed doesn't bleed energy at all. But it is still a bit of a brick that can pull some good high AOA. Now, this doesn't necessarily mean that these people who are complaining about the MiG-29 are right or wrong. Because they're both. And right now the big thing is the F-16 is crazily overperforming. And I'll be making a video talking about that later. But the MiG-29 right now, as is, does not need to be the way that it is right now. So, how can we fix this? Well, first off, Gaijin can maybe implement, you know, actual flight models and introduce, you know, individual flight models for individual aircraft. That would be great to see in the game. So, really, it comes down to, as from what I've seen for the community, is the community needs to understand a couple things. One... The MiG-29 is a good aircraft, okay, but it is not to par or on par or better than the American F-16, especially the F-18, and the F-15, I mean, it can compete with the F-15, let's, I, I won't, I'm not, I'm not gonna sit here and say that the MiG-29 is a perfect aircraft that can go into a merge with an American aircraft and win every single fight. Now, IRL, it you know, what surprised American aviators when testing against it is the fact that it could pull some high AOA and with the Archer or R-73, it has a 45 degree nose cone in front of it where you basically are dead. Now, IRL in an actual, you know, fight, I don't think the MiG-29 is going to be able to hold its own against an F-18 or an F-16 or an F-15. Age has not tweeted, tw uh, t <laughs> the age has not suited the MiG-29 at all. So, when it came out, first came out in the 70s, it was definitely an aircraft that could pull some really unique things. Even throughout the 80s, it was still an aircraft that could do some wonders. But, I want to point out that in actual real life to, you know, in real life combat situations, the MiG-29 does not perform as well as the F-15 or F-16. So, that is a big thing that I keep hearing, and especially in Discord. And just throughout the community, MiG-29 is underperforming. It is, you know, should be better than the F-15 or F-16. And that's simply not the case. It is not better than an F-15 or an F-16. But it needs to be performing better. I do think if you put mutual same pilot, same skill, the F-16 should win. But if you put a pilot who has a bit higher skill in a MiG-29, MiG-29 is going to start to be able to win a lot more easily. This doesn't necessarily show the fact that the MiG-29 is underperforming or overperforming. It really comes down to the fact that people need to start understanding that the MiG-29 is how it's going to be. It's not the worst aircraft in War Thunder right now. It's not Gaijin's, you know, biggest worry. I do think if it got, you know, we get individual flight models, that'd be very nice. I do think the MiG-29 needs to be a little bit better or at least the f-16s need to get the actual correct flight model i'm not going to sit here and say that the f-16 is 110 times better than the mig-29 they're closer to par than i really realized but 
the MiG-29 is simply not as good as the F-16 or F-15, and I'll stand by that. Now, a lot of you guys are going to look over and say, well, there's been people who flew in both, and they say the MiG-29 is way better. So, the way I look at that is, there's two or three people that have flown both aircraft, one really in particular, one document, and he does point out and say the MiG-29 is better than the F-15 and F-16, but... At the same time, this is something that the United States has had access to for a while. We have MiG-29s. That's no secret. We have Russian aircraft, okay, that we buy them from third-party countries or we do whatever we need to do. We've tested the MiG-29 against our own aircraft. We tested Russian missiles against our own aircraft or Russian reverse-engineered missiles against things. We haven't seen a noticeable change in the doctrine and use of the F-15 or F-16. Okay, that is enough for me to sit back and comfortably say the United States does not view the MiG-29 as a th aircraft that is better than the F-16 or F-15. Now, again, guys, this doesn't necessarily mean the MiG-29 is bad. It just means, end of day, that the war thunder community needs to understand that is the MiG-29 underperforming? Yes. Is it a massive deal? Not really. Should it get fixed? Absolutely. Is the MiG-29 going to get fixed and then be better than the F-15 or F-16? Absolutely not. Should it be closer to on par? Yes. That is really the hope of this you know, video. Again, it's just basically abbreviated to the fact that the MiG-29 is not going to come out of the gate and be on par with the F-16 or F-15, but it does need to be closer. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Discord will be linked in the description as usual. Make sure to comment down below what sort of videos you guys want to see. And I will catch you guys in the next video.